today I'll be showing you a few of my favorite ways to decorate the home for Valentine's Day. So you'll just need some Mod Podge, some candles, tape, glitter, paint, mason jars, and some stencils, which I got from Michael's Craft Store. So you just want to unpeel the stencil and place it on the mason jar. And then I've placed some paper underneath the mason jar just so I don't get anything messy and all over the place. <laughs> So I'm just going to glue the interior of the stencil, making sure that it's completely coated. And then I'll sprinkle some glitter on it and remove the stencil. And that's it for the first one. For the second one, you could use spray paint, but I'm just going to use regular acrylic craft paint. So I'm just placing the stencil over the mason jar and painting over it with some white paint. Of course, you could use pink or red or whatever you want to use and let that dry a little and then you unpeel the stencil for this one and that's about it for these all you really need to do is take the lids off and place whatever you want inside like makeup brushes candy candles or pencils whatever you like This next one is my favorite and all you need is some Mod Podge spray, glue, glitter, and wooden letters from Michaels. So let's get started. The first thing that I'm doing is coating the entire front side of the letters with glue just to make sure that the glitter will stick. And next I'm just going to cover the entire thing with glitter. You can use whatever kind you want but I just love the look of this sparkly translucent glitter it just looks romantic and gorgeous and then you just want to repeat this with the other letters I'm using XOXO of course you could do love or be mine that would be cute too this one's really simple I just grabbed some oversized candlestick holders from Target and some glistening sparkly glasses and I'm just placing some candy inside to have around the home for my son or for any other guests that might stop by around Valentine's Day. And I also grabbed this cute little heart candy dish from Michaels. And of course you gotta have the classic Brock's candy hearts around the home. So that's it guys. Those are my DIY Valentine's Day decor ideas. Let me know in the comments below or tweet me and Instagram me if you decide to try any of these DIYs out. And also make sure that you like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.